In the Philippines, this is the process of putting together, assembling these massive uh, Rio bar. They're a good inch and a half, almost two inches in size. And they have to be all wired together. This is the top. That is obviously the top there. This one here goes to the bottom. There's six of these to go in to create the supports for the bridge. As you can see, they're still assembling this piece. They work from within the frame and also on the outside. They're picking up these great big lengths of um, steel and then they wire them all together in sequence. Massive area. It's almost like a boat shell like a hole, but a circular one. This is their job. They maybe 10 or 12 guys doing this all the day. And they've now got uh, four assembled here, almost, almost completed four. I believe there's one down at the back of the bridge, but they've chosen to do them up here. So they'll have another one to do here. So just an update on the progress here of the bridge here in Capritan Sur where they're so happy to see me in the morning the time is 10 to 7 in the morning and they're bright and shiny out of bed had a wash working hard today see how friendly they are they're always friendly here in the Philippines these are the steel sleeves that they place in the hole um, to hold back the ground when they pour the concrete in the hole. And some of the heavy equipment used for drilling is already in place. This is the one of the heavy drill rigs that will be used to drill down into the ground, sub down in the subsoil, down to the level of rock, hopefully down below. And as you can see in the background, there's one of those uh, Rio bar ready to go into place. They made that one up here on site. But um, this is how they do it. And they will be drilling alongside the bridge here. And there's equipment that process. So I hope you enjoyed watching it. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye now.